tonight, a husband and a wife murdered in their home in front of their little granddaughter. The crime scene hundreds of miles away, but police say the killer is here in South Florida. The couple were killed in Alabama. And then today in Miami Beach and in Hollywood, people wanted in this case were busted by police. CBS 4's Hank Tester live in West Miami Dade, where one of those suspects is being held tonight. Hank. Birmingham police detectives have been in town wrapping up a murder case, and they got lots of help from two local police agencies. Here's the very latest. A little girl found wandering in the street in East Birmingham. She has bloodstained clothes, says her grandparents are dead. Police are called. They go into the home and find 67-year-old Mary Holt and 68-year-old Steve Holt homicide victims. Birmingham police send detectives to South Florida where there was an arrest in the case. Okay, we got yeah. it. It's a stolen car from Alabama. Yeah. This is 30-year-old Christian Guillon in Miami-Dade bond court, picked up on South Point, Miami Beach, illegally parked. License plate comes back to the murdered Alabama grandparents. She tells the beach police officer it was her friend's car. And in situations like this, her father told her to keep her mouth shut. Birmingham police requested she be extradited to face charges in Alabama. She waives extradition. She is from Alabama, Your Honor. She was on the extradition calendar this morning and waived extradition. This is a great break in the case, and we're hoping this will help resolve the entire situation. But they're going to work there on that end with the information that they have from the Miami Beach Police Department, and they're going to work hand in hand and try to determine exactly how that vehicle ended up there. Mid afternoon, these are Chopper 4 aerials over Hollywood, Florida. Hollywood police Police have made an arrest in the case. These are pictures over Roosevelt and Dixie Highway. Hollywood police confirming they've arrested Zachary Taylor Phillips, who's connected to the death of the Alabama grandparents. The suspect was in a stolen vehicle that crashed into a street sign. Phillips attempted to flee before Hollywood cops detained him. Well, last check, Zachary Phillips had still not been booked into the Broward County Jail. Eventually, he'll face an extradition hearing. That's the very latest. I'm Hank Tester, CBS 4 News. Back to you.